Mark, interesting looking gear you've got. How does it all work and how would I choose what suits me? Well, what we've got here, Macca, is a uh, touring unit. This is our most popular unit. It's the one that suits most caravanners, but you can travel vehicle alone, so you can pop your caravan off at Turkey Creek, go out to the Bungle Bungles using this unit, come back in, pick up, and then continue on your way around Australia. Mate, just the mention of those two names, and I actually want one now. So what, how do you find most people will utilise the storage space? The trick is with this is to make things quick and easy and to make it simple. Uh, we call it the five finger rule, so if you can't put your, five, your fingers on the five things when you need them, uh, they're in the wrong spot. So in this unit here, up on the top, uh, this is a touring unit, uh, this is a drop down soft luggage rack. This utilises the space above the rear vision mirror height for soft things, pillows, sleeping bags, jackets, towels, all those bulky soft things that get in the way and are difficult to get to. Slam shut, you can still see through with your centre rear vision mirror. If you continue on down through the unit, we can have Southern Cross tents or A tent style in through here. Um, we put a table up in on the top there for when we're doing the uh, Simpson Deserts, soft storage. Uh, if I'm going away with my dog, four bolts, this will allow this shelf to be removed. Uh, it gives access here for suitcases and or animals or whatever. And then to the left hand side, generally we mount the fridges down low so it's user friendly access. Keeping them down low allows you to move it in and out single handed so you can get to things quickly and easily. Side pockets in over the wheel arch. Um, this is predominantly where we use quick recovery gear, snatch straps, bow shackles, second jacks, uh, often a thermos and things along those lines. And then you've still got your drawer space onto the side here. Large drawer, so it's all steel construction. And in through this is where you put most of your gear that you need to get to every time quickly and easily. And we still utilise the space in over these, the wheel arches on either side. Have you got a setup that's really good for someone who's going long term touring in a wagon? Yeah, we've just brought online the 200 seats in unit. Uh, which allows you to put a 40 fridge slide and a drawer and still remain, have your third row of seats remaining in place so you can just drop them down when you need to. So you can have the storage system in there, a couple of bolts, take out one part, drop the seats down and away you go. So you can still carry your passengers. Yep, it's ideal for those people that go away, want their grandkids to come up, cart them around for a few weeks, bundle them back off home and then continue on their trip. So there you go, folks. If you want to turn the storage space in the back of your vehicle, which is pretty much inaccessible now into something you can really use and it's handy. Get and see Mark and the team at Fullby Fitouts and they'll get you sorted out with one of these setups or one that suits you.